My name is Joseph McDermott. I'm the Executive Director of the Nebraska State Fair. First, I want to welcome each of you and thank you for coming to the announcement of what is a first for the Nebraska State Fair and what I know is only the beginning of great things to come. As you know, sponsorships play an important role in what we can provide for fairgoers from throughout our great state. Sponsorships help us keep our gate prices low, provide free concerts and other entertainment, and provide for the thousands of 4-H and FFA and open class exhibitors for both livestock and domestic entries. All told, it takes in excess of $5 million each year to produce Nebraska's largest entertainment event. A couple of months ago, we began talks with Bill Marshall, chairman of the board for Five Points Bank of Grand Island. He had inquired about the possibility of growing the investment of Five Points Bank in the Nebraska State Fair. We talked about a couple of possibilities, but ultimately he, his family, and his top lieutenants chose to become the first sponsor, <coughs> the first sponsor to invest in the naming rights of our buildings, and their choice was the Livestock Arena. Five Points ultimately committed $75,000 per year for the next 10 years for a total sponsorship level of $750,000. This sponsorship allows for an endowment for Fauner Park to use in the upkeep of the Five Points Bank Arena for the 10 months of the year that it's under their care. Five Points has long been a leader in not only the banking community, but also a community leader supporting the so many worthwhile causes throughout the years with a keenly focused eye towards the future of not just Grand Island, but our great state of Nebraska. I cannot begin to tell you <clears throat> what an honor it is to make this announcement today. And we welcome Bill Marshall, Chairman of the Board for Five Points Bank to the podium. I'm very pleased to be able to do this signed sponsorship for a couple of reasons. First of all, it gives support to Foner Park and the Nebraska State Fair. We think that both Foner Park and the State Fair have contributed a great deal to our community in terms of economic benefit and quality of life and are very worthy of support. Secondly, we feel this, is a, this investment is good business. The people that come to the State Fair, cattle shows, danger games, horse races, concerts, or any other event out here are either customers of our bank or people we would like to be customers of our bank. In either case, we think it makes good sense to keep our name before these people. We are very happy to be involved and hope that it works out to be a great decision for our bank, Fonder Park, the State Fair, and most of all, for the community. Thank you. And now for the unveiling of the Five Points Bank Arena. I now call to the uh, podium uh, Hugh Miner, CEO and General Manager of Fauner Park. Fauner Park over the years has had the pleasure uh, to be the center of many good things that have happened in this community for close to 60 years. The most recent, of course, is the building of the $42 million State Fair Complex for which the Five Points Arena is part of. We also have to thank uh, our community leaders who went down to Lincoln and, and uh, lobbied the legislature to move the State Fair to Grand Island and the work that has transpired and, and what's happened since then, the fact that what you see today um, going into our third year having the State Fair in Grand Island, Nebraska, it, it has grown um, and it will continue to grow. The generosity of our community, I believe, is unmatched at every level. And 
Five Points Bank exemplifies the, the giving spirit of not only our community, but for our entire state. This is not news, but instead it really is a continuation of what Five Points Bank has stood for since its inception. As uh, Joseph mentioned, uh, Fauner Park is a beneficiary of an endowment from Five Points sponsorship that will give us additional funds to maintain the building and, and keep it in great shape for years to come. And that's a piece of the puzzle that's extremely important to be able to maintain the facility. We give our thanks to Bill Marshall and Five Points Bank for an investment that will continue to, be, to pay dividends for many years to come.